are y'all doing, girl? Look at this busted old <laughs> girl, a mess. So y'all know how we do. This is time for another chit chat. Chit chat remix, chit chat video, y'all. I'm moving stuff around because you know I ain't never ready. So we know how we do this. We talk about what's going on in our personal life, what I'm watching on YouTube, and what I'm watching on TV, girl. So what we're gonna be doing is um taking down these twists and making them a little bit bigger because I got somewhere to go in the morning. Look at those long twists. I got somewhere to go tomorrow and I ain't gonna have time. So we need to make these twists a little bit juicier. So we're gonna retwist. I'm going to have to wash my hair. Oh, y'all. I'll do it on Martin Luther King Day. I'm just saying that. I'm trying to say because I have a lot of stuff going on this week. It's JB's birthday. My baby is a preteen. Can y'all believe that? He's a preteen. So let's just jump right into it, you guys. I'm going to be using Cantu products on my hair. Um, and like I stated, I'm going to make these smaller. I'm going to leave that because I think that's going to be cute and juicy. But I'm trying to see what I can, yeah, let's leave those two and make, combine those two. So I'm going to show y'all some stuff I've been buying because <laughs> I just said, I just told y'all that I would stop buying stuff. And then, you know, I started looking at stuff. My husband started looking at stuff. We started comparing notes. And before you know it, I spent $200 through Amazon. I spent some money this morning, got an assortment of stuff. I have been looking, I'm all about body stuff, you guys. Forget hair stuff now, hair products. I'm on the body skin product thing. And just to let you know, I do have that skin regimen coming up, but I keep changing it. Meaning, I keep adding to the skin regimen. And so, I like to give it a good month to see any results. And I think I'm, I'm doing good. I'm doing good. I was having some issues there for a while, but I'm being a little bit more consistent with my products. So let me show y'all one thing that I've added um, to my regimen, and that is another toner. I use Rose Water Toner, okay? I got this through Amazon. I will be linking it in the cards. And I tone a lot. I tone after I wash. I tone after I exfoliate. I tone after I done. So I tone like three times now in between it. Um, just to get it all in. And so now some body products, girl, I have a couple of body products I've been using and I'm all about layering my products to get, to see what smells the best on me. I've been using Caresses Shea Butter and Brown Sugar Exfoliating Body Wash. Now I do all of this together. After that, I moisturize my skin with EOS Shea Butter 24 Hour vanilla cashmere then i spray my whole body down girl why are you doing that the whole body down with open sky fine fragrance mist so let me tell you when i pair these two together it's heaven sent this brown sugar with this what vanilla with the vanilla cashmere heaven sent then don't have to use a lot when i spray my body down with this open sky I have gotten so many compliments from people on, what are you wearing? Like, what is that? It's so funny. I, when I was up in Long Beach seeing my family, even my niece was like, what are you wearing? I said, oh, I'll have this open sky body mist. She said, uh-uh. No, you wearing something else. It ain't adding up. So I told her everything I was wearing. And I actually gave her my bottle I had on hand of the open sky. Because um, I knew I could just get this real quick. And again, I'll link this to below in the car. So you can get these at your local grocery store, Target, Walmart, whatever. But baby, this, I was telling my husband how I'm getting compliments. And he's at compliments. Who's, who's compliment? I said, oh, Shia. Girl, you, I gotta correct that real fast. Don't no man want to hear about his wife, his wife, um, getting compliments. And it, it was a compliment from a young man. He was very young, but I think he played for the other team. So, um, but he was like, "What are you wearing?" I'm like, "Oh, child, let me tell you." But yeah, y'all, that right there. So let me put these two together because this is this is a bit much. So, those you don't know, uh, my husband is in Kansas, and so he's coming back next month i'm so excited to see him i'm going to book him an in-house um massage so i sent him some information and i said you know what the first week that you're here 
I'm going to, I've already contacted the young lady and she says she does do home visits and she lives right in our subdivision. Um, and so, I'll, you know, you deserve this. So when you get here, this is on me. So yeah, child, he sent me some stuff too. Talking about, I ain't going to go into detail. He's like, I got you some stuff. I'm like, what did you get me? Child, he, this is going to add to my collection. Look, he got me some vanilla body oil. So yeah, I'm excited for him to come back. JB is doing okay in school. Um, my baby is having some type of like, there are some type of upper respiratory things going around. We, JB and I experienced it towards the end of, getting towards the end of last year. So like beginning December, but I think now it's floating around everywhere. Um, <clears throat> yeah, I think I'm okay now. Wait, what is this? What is this? Now her ass needs to be combined. So put some oil on my scalp just a little bit and pull my hair back. Um, and then I'm also going to be touring a new school for JB um, this week. So that's what's going on with the personal life. YouTube, what I'm watching on YouTube right now, everybody is going crazy because Cat Williams has gone viral. I'm going to say this. I'm going to put on some lipstick, y'all. I'm going to go really dark. Um, I haven't watched the video. Even my husband sent it to me. Um, that's too dark. I've seen bits and pieces, but I'm, I'm not trying to, you know, I'm not trying to be a hater or whatever, but I don't feel like he's seen anything that we haven't heard before. You know what I mean? And correct me if I'm wrong, because he's saying that, you know, that, of course, about the Illuminati, Anybody, any man that has any black man, excuse me, specifically any black man that has worn a dress in Hollywood, they have, that's code for something, basically. Next Friday, one of the Fridays, with, what's his name? From Alabama, country ass. Ricky Smiley, on who was going to get the role of Santa Claus versus the pimp. It's just going back. And then he's just going in on all types of people. Not necessarily going in, but these people, because these people apparently has also said things about Cat Williams. So and in a way, I feel like he was defending himself. I think that there's a lot of truth to what he says, but I also feel like he embellishes on some things. That's just my opinion. Again, I feel like a good 80% of what he's saying is truth, but there's a twist on it because it's Cat Williams. You know what I mean? Um... I I think he doesn't hold back and I admire that about him. But he's a comedian. That's what they do, right? So I again I'm not really interested in seeing the full interview, but I have seen bits of pieces with him and Shannon Sharp. Yes, yeah, Shannon Sharp is so damn goofy to me. Um Gypsy Rose, y'all. Gypsy Rose is out. She's a free woman. And she's apparently married. I don't know if she got married behind bars. But she's married to some big old booger wolf. I, <laughs> I shouldn't say that. I should not say that. God forgive me. She found love. Lord forgive me. That's not nice. That's really not nice. I'm trying to be nice. That's not nice. Because she found love. And I feel so bad for her. Gypsy Rose. For those of you who don't know, there was a full on. There's been several movies about this. But the one that was it was on. I think it's on Hulu. And what does it call you guys? Um, God, I forgot the name. Is it The Act? I think it's called The Act. Gypsy Rose and her crazy mama, rest in peace, Dee Dee. Dee Dee suffered from an extreme case of Munchausen by proxy. And that is when a mother or a close love, loved one, 80% of the time, it is the mother, harms the child for attention. In this case, Dee Dee was doing it not only for attention for herself, but also money. money. They came, they moved to, an, uh, um, I don't know what state they moved to, but they were victims of Hurricane Katrina. Basically, Dee Dee was horrible. She was slowly killing her daughter. And there has been some speculation that she possibly even killed her mother. A sister or somebody's sister-in-law said that she poisoned her. Gypsy Rose had all this stuff happen to her and she met this guy online and they plotted to kill the mom, which they did. And in a horrible way, that woman died a horrible death. After she died, she was cremated. They gave the ashes to the family. And I don't know if it was her daddy or somebody. 
and we basically put her ashes in the in the toilet and flush it i was like oh my so no one had anything good to say about this woman everyone is on the same accord they are glad that gypsy has been released what else girl i'm on the true crime kick still again i'm on i'm on it and this is kind of sad but i test jb i'll look at a, a interview now my thing is integrations i live for the integrations because i want to see what you're going to say and it still kills me that these people get on there whether you innocent or guilty they get on there and they talk for hours without a lawyer and so every now and then i just did it this morning with jb i said jb this is an 18 year old being um he's he's the the cops just want to ask him some questions that's what they want to do. They want to be your friend. They want to ask you, you, you're not here for that. We just want to ask you some questions. You know, you can walk out whenever. This is how they set the stage to make the person feel comfortable. You can walk out whenever you want. So I'll send, you know, I'll show JB, excuse me, the first few clips. I don't let him listen to all of it. So I'm like, JB, what is wrong with this? What is wrong with this picture? I'll show you in the video. I said, first of all, this is a child. Well, he's technically an adult. He's 18. So, but what is wrong with this picture? He's like, First of all, mama, he's talking. I said, what else is wrong with this? He's like, and he's not asking for a lawyer. Gotta teach him. Like, seriously, you gotta teach him because they are there. You not asking for a lawyer. You making their jobs very easy. Anyway, so true crime. Baby, I'm over the gender wars. I think it's kind of, I hope that it's kind of slowing down, but I'm over it, y'all. I'm over it. It's played the hell out. What I'm watching, you guys, first off, Please don't sleep on YouTube. Netflix, Hulu, y'all better get it together because YouTube, y'all, YouTube has so many cool free videos that are out right now. I'm just going to name some a few that I've seen that are free right now on YouTube. Point Blank, Jeepers Creepers, Crazy Butt, Fried Green Tomatoes. Look, y'all, I have to tell my... <laughs> I told my mama recently that the two main characters and fried green tomatoes were lesbians were lesbians so she got quiet she's like hmm i said yeah so do you want to watch it <laughs> um boomerang is out I wa i've watched it like two or three times now just for you know to watch it karina karina my favorite movie i started to watch one of my favorite movies i started to watch it with whoopi goldberg and the guy from casino bless his heart um, y'all know that child was the same, uh, teenager that was in Napoleon Dynamite. And I love me some Percy, that little cute little kid. All those kids are adults now, if you think about it. Because I was a child when that movie came out. I think I was like, yeah, I was a teenager. But anyway, Karina, Karina is on YouTube. But there's tons of different f free movies on YouTube. And once you click on one, you get recommendations for other ones. So that's what I've been watching. I started to watch Equalizer 3 on Netflix, but... I'm not really feeling it. I maybe I have to stop and rewatch it, but I don't know. True Detective, you guys. True, in my opinion, True Detective is one of those series that is. Gosh, the episode, the seasons have been so awesome, especially season one and two, just awesome. So there's another season coming out with Jodie Foster. I'm gonna have to go ahead. I think it's gonna be on Stars. I'm not sure yet, or HBO. I'm gonna have to go ahead and get that when it's out. Cause I like me some Jodie Foster and I love True Detective. Shining Veil. I got Stars back and it's not even on there. Season two is not available. So I'm like, what the heck is going on? Watching Shining Veil, where the heck can I find it at? Cause I really wanna watch it. So yeah, you guys, that's what I'm doing. That's what I've been watching. I really am, I know it's 2024, we made it y'all, and I really am trying to take the time to take care of myself. This is why I got some of this stuff, and my husband got me some stuff, so it could be for me and to take care of myself, y'all. Oh, let me show y'all my purses I got, and this is it, we done. I can't be buying any more purses, because legit, most of the purses I have purchased, because this is, this is my reasoning. Purses actually get old, and they start to crumble and die. So, yeah, so anyway, I got this purse recently. Isn't this cute? Like, this is a good, sturdy, good, handy purse, but I don't like this strap. I feel like this strap really doesn't go with it, so I am going to take it off, but this is a good, good, good. It's heavy, too. It's good. Not heavy, but it has some weight to it. <clears throat> and then this purse came last night. I know. This is good, too. Look at this. Ooh, look at that emerald green. This is winter 
Look at that crocodile image. This is nice. Um, we're going to be going out to eat to our favorite restaurant, but this man went ahead and booked us at the Omni Resort. I cannot wait. I was going to actually get him a um, massage there, but no, I need the massage here so I can see what that hussy is doing. <laughs> I, yeah, you need to come on. I need to see what you're going to be. I'm not going to be interrupting you. That's not, that's inappropriate. But anyway, um, I have a cute maroon wine colored dress. And I'm going to be pairing it with this because this will be that pop of nice, bold color to go with it. So, yeah, y'all. So, anyway, you guys, that is it. Thank you so much for watching. Please be patient with me. Skin video is coming out soon. Expect that within the next two weeks. And so, yeah, thank you so much for watching. Take care. Bye.